Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to show you how I made over $100,000 playing Fortnite. Enjoy. We're going to go in depth with all the money I made from content creation, being on an esports team, streaming full time on Twitch, sponsors and tournaments. I hope this video can guide a lot of you guys in the right direction, as I know a lot of my viewers are from gaming and Fortnite. So I really hope that this video opens your eyes as to what it's actually like to be a decently big gaming content creator on YouTube and a professional esports player. So let's jump straight into it. So right here, we have my YouTube page with 136,000 subscribers. As you can see right here, I got over 13 million views on my channel and how much money did this make me? Before we get into that, we got to go a little more back. I made my first YouTube video public six years ago, but I've actually been using this channel for a lot longer. All right, guys, so if we go back, we can see that my first ever video on this was an NBA 2K16 video on June 20th of 2016. And before this, I had a ton of other channels. I want to say this is like the first channel I had. Eight years ago, I uploaded a video on Call of Duty Black Ops 2. We have another channel of mine here, which was nine years ago. And by the way, these channels will be at the end of the video. Actually, no, I'm not even put the video. So, you know, I've been doing YouTube for about nine years. Definitely not consistently, but like it wasn't an overnight success. I've always wanted to do it. The first video game that I was actually able to compete in was Rocket League, but I wasn't old enough, but I was top of the top. And then I went over to Fortnite and that's where things really changed. You know, back in 2018, so about four years ago now, I joined Chronic and I started making YouTube videos and we're gonna get right into how much money I made while being in Chronic. So my first ever video on Fortnite was this video in July, 2022, 2018. I was not in Chronic, but I was already uploading Fortnite videos. This is where stuff got serious and I started uploading a lot more. My videos got a lot of traction like this video, who's the fastest builder in Chronic? I tried out for a fake Chronic plan and this happened. All these videos that were mainly, you know, for the Fortnite audience started taking off and getting a lot of views. And I got 1.3 million views which equated to $594. So from June 2018 to March 10th, 2019, we made $600 uploading every single day. We weren't streaming yet on Twitch at this point. So that was really the only money I had made from Fortnite. Then if we push like one more year, now I'm just gonna show you everything so that we're not here forever and we can actually get into other things. But as you can see here, we made $15,000 total from YouTube. It's more than that and I'll get into why it's not showing up now, but March 17th of 2019, while we were in Chronic, we uploaded a video that has 6 million views. This video still brings in money every single day. You know, we had some videos pop off. So let me show you guys exactly how much money this video made. A video with 6 million views made me $5,000. And a lot of the revenue actually stopped. I'm gonna get into that why. It didn't stop, it still made me money, but I'll get into it why. So this kept making money until April 20 of 2020. So for the first 3.6 million views, it made me $5,000. And then for the other, it made me around like another 3,000. So this video made around $8,000 total. The reason why the rest of the money is not here is because if you guys have been following me for a while, I actually was not on Google AdSense for a very long time. I was on an esports org called Overtime. I paid Fortnite for them and they had their own network. So over time, the sports brand, yes, the one that you see all the basketball highlights from, they actually have an esports team. And as you guys can see here, if you just look up Overtime Gaming launches following Evade acquisition, I was in a team called Evade with a bunch of my friends and Overtime bought us out. Yeah, so I ended up signing with their network, which means the money that I was making, I was getting paid through there. And we'll, we'll go into that now. So when Overtime actually bought Evade, this was my first time ever being on a salary. I was getting paid $500 a month for about a year. You know, that was my salary for being on this esports org until I left overtime and joined different orgs, but we'll get into that now. So as you can see here, in 2020 of me joining overtime, I made a total of $6,338. All these $500 checks that you see here are the salary and the extra money that you see here, like the 203, the 99, the 152, the 164, is all extra from YouTube, especially the 720, that was all extra. So that's 2020. I was also on overtime for a bit on 2021 where we got paid $500 for my salary. Then we got an extra pay of $1,900. This was from YouTube, my $500 salary, and then an extra payment of 826. Okay, so from YouTube total, we made $20,000 in like my five years of uploading Fortnite. So $20,000 from just uploading YouTube. I think it's only fair now if we get into how much money I made from being on esports teams. So if we add all these payments up, so we made a total of $6,000 from my salary from being on overtime. Also, I was very thankful for my time on overtime. Literally the best org, the best team. The owner, Hantao, literally set me on the right path of life. He was the reason I got into NFTs and literally am where I am today. So if you're watching this, thank you for everything you've always done for me. 
I just wanted to put that out there because I loved overtime. All right, so we made $20,000 from YouTube, $6,000 from Beyond Overtime. That is a current total of $26,000. Now we're gonna go over to Twitch and see how much money I made from being a full-time streamer. For about a year, I really went full-time. I was averaging a ton of viewers streaming every single tournament and I had a good amount of subscribers. So we're gonna see right now how much I made from being a full-time streamer. I have 62,000 followers. I still have four subscribers. Oh my God, loyal. So in the last 30 days, I've made $23 without streaming once nice passive income baby passive income all right guys so if you see here i put the start date at september 21st of 2018 all the way to today as you can see it says that we averaged 112 viewers but you know this isn't taking into account my peak my peak i say i averaged around 300 viewers every single tournament and we made a total of twelve thousand dollars this is not including donations because this is only what through twitch i made around two thousand dollars from paid subs two thousand from prime subs two, almost three thousand from gifted subs 3,000 from ads, 2.5K from bits. So this brings our grand total from Twitch to $12,000. So we currently have 20,000 from YouTube, 6,000 from overtime, 12,000 from Twitch, not including donations, but I'm not gonna include those because I don't know how to find those. We're currently at $38,000 from playing Fortnite. And then right after we left overtime, we signed to a different org called Nine Lives. As you can see right there, I got paid $17.50 per month Plus, I got a one-time signing bonus of $500. By the way, I can definitely show this one because they actually ended up scamming the whole team out of like the last two or three months and we never got paid, but we did get paid for a few months. So for about a year right here, as you can see, this video has 47,000 views. I joined the team Nine Lives and we didn't get paid for last month. And then the next month, we also were like trying to get paid. So we just didn't get paid one month. So if we do 1750 times four, we made $7,000 from being on Nine Lives plus a $500 signing bonus. Our current total is at $45,500. So everything here is blurred because, you know, this was like a official contract and stuff, but I was getting paid 3,500 when I left Nine Lives from another team called Nova. I was on Nova for about five months. As you can see, I joined Nova on June of 2021. And I was honestly on Nova all the way till December. And I wasn't even uploading Fortnite the last two months. So that was six months of being on Nova, getting paid $3,500. So we made $21,000 from being signed to this team, which brings our grand total so far to $66,500. That's all the money that I made from being signed on orgs, YouTube, Twitch. So I'm going to say like throughout my five years, I maybe got like an extra $5,000 from sponsorships for like merch, drinks, stuff like that. And then the biggest money actually came when I was quitting. Um, I got an offer to stream on Facebook. If any of you guys remember that, I started streaming on Facebook and I left Twitch. And that right there was over 3,500. I'm not going to say the exact amount, but it was over 3,500. It was over what Nova was paying me. I was on Facebook for about five months. We're just going to go ahead and add $20,000 to our final and Facebook was paying a lot for streamers back in the day. So that was honestly a huge opportunity for me. And it allowed me to lay back, chill, get into like NFTs and stuff and really focus on that because I was making so much money. I was comfortable, you know, from Nova, from Facebook. And I got the Facebook deal through my agency, Carter Pulse. Right there, Carter Pulse Esports Management, they helped me through everything in my journey. They're honestly a very, very big reason as to where I am today. So guys, the total so far is up to $91,500. And now we're gonna get into the final thing. How much money did I make from playing tournaments in Fortnite? Okay, so as you guys can see here, we made $2,500 from NA East. We made $200 from Europe Fortnite. And then guys, TwitchCon 2020, me, Ducky the Gamer, and Mustache made $9,000 plus another $1,600 for making it to heat. So we made each around $4,000 and if anybody remembers this, TwitchCon 2019 is like my best moment in gaming. The thing that I look back to and I'm like, wow, that was the moment that everybody aspires to be on. Being on the main stage in front of thousands of people, hundreds, if not millions of people watching online. And all right. Yeah, we were the kings of retail. We killed Blyfo. I remember that was that was awesome. Um, from that, I think we made around ten thousand dollars. So split three thousand each because we got a couple kills. I think we got the most kills that game. I don't remember. None of this online, like the per game stats. So we're going to go ahead and add another 3000 from that. And that's the end of the video. So from YouTube, we made a total of $20,000. From Twitch, we made $12,000, bringing our total to 32000 From our salary on overtime, we made 6000 That's 38000 From our salary from Nine Lives, that brought our total to 45500 Our salary at Nova brought our total to 66500 Sponsors, 
brought our total to 71,000. Our Facebook contract brought the total to 91,000. And then these tournaments that I just showed you brought the total to 93,500 plus 293. We made $101,500 from playing Fortnite. This is not including like donations, third party tournaments that I played. These are all just official stuff that is all online. Yeah, we made $100,000 playing Fortnite. I actually never, I never added that up myself. That's, uh, yeah, that, that's pretty fucking crazy. And I was, I was not one of the best. What am I saying? I was actually pretty fucking crazy. But, you know, like, I wasn't Booga or Clicks. Those people are making millions of dollars. I honestly didn't even know that I made 100K from playing Fortnite. That's, uh, that's pretty wild. So, yeah. I made my first $100,000 playing video games. Keep in mind. I was in a very good position. I put myself to network with a lot of great people that helped me get to where I am. But yeah, I made my first six figures being a full-time streamer, a full-time YouTuber, and a competitive Fortnite player. If you want to do it, it's possible. I mean, I did not have any sort of advantage at all. I literally started out on console. I wasn't like crazy, crazy until the end. Then I got pretty crazy. But yeah, if you guys got to the end of this video, I want you guys to go over to my Instagram, orangeyt and dm me the number nine if you give me the number nine i have a surprise for you thank you guys for watching to the end of the video you guys are the absolute best i really hope you guys enjoyed these type of finance videos i really enjoyed breaking down how much money i made because i actually didn't even know first six figures from fortnite that's interesting it's been your boy orange oh i can't even say that anymore oh my god it's been gabe or orangey i'm no longer orange <laughs> and i'm out